Hello everyone, I call myself Zonderskind and I like to play Civilization 6 and we're on the 8th challenge of the marathon with Pericles of Greece. I'll cut in my talking about the challenge and the kit right now. Let's look at his abilities. Surrounded by glory plus 5% culture per city state you are the suzerain of. Absolutely amazing ability, especially on single player where you can uh, quite easily take hold of a lot of suzerain teeth throughout the game. Uh, it also compounds with the fact that as Greece you will have more envoys than other civs, which we'll get to. Platus Republic, one extra wildcard policy slot in any government, also an S tier ability. You ha basically have Forbidden City in your kit already, and the people from YouTube know that I already said that when looking at the Gorgo kit. The Hoplite is a genuinely good Spearman replacement because it gets extra combat strength adjacent to other Hoplites. Uh, which means they hold their own much better in the ancient classical era and Because of that they can get to some genuinely good promotions by the time they get to pike and pike and shots in the end Enter cavalry will always have the problem that Between like spearman and, and pike and shot you only have three kinds of enter cavalry You only have three steps whereas melee units have five between the warrior and the line infantry So it's just much more gradual much more much more controllable but um, a, a Greek anti cavalry army is one that can genuinely work. And the Acropolis is a great um, special district. Replace the theater square and it awards one envoy when completed, which synergizes really well with Surrounded by Glory. Also, it gets a standard adjacency from each district la rather than a minor adjacency. And specifically from the city center, it gets a major adjacency. That's basically what that bottom paragraph means. As for the achievements for this game, we have Odyssea, recruit 4 plus great writers, the Minotaur's Labyrinth, build a wonder on the faraway continent, note that it is a terra map, the Trojan Horse, finish with a cavalry class unit on the same tile as a spy, the Delian League, be the first Susan of 5 plus city states and alcohol is free, finish with open borders to all opponents and or international trade routes from all cities. So, you will see how I did these achievements in the playlist. Let's get into it. Thank you for getting us past the threshold of 982 subscribers and meanwhile past the threshold of 1000. I wanted to compare two municipalities in the Netherlands and we've now gone past the smallest municipality. The next milestone will be 1254. So, let me spin a nice little narrative as if we've settled on the island. Welcome to Zonderskinnedijk. We have a lighthouse, a town hall, and public transportation with buses. It's all the things that Schiermonnik Oog had, has, has. There's nothing wrong here. Don't investigate. The people of Schiermonnik Oog are fine. Uh, please don't ask me who the man in the corner is. Uh, this is, uh, I don't know, Hank, Hank. He, he's, he's just a local fisherman with some local v v fisherman friends who wants to visit another island. So please uh, give us more subscribers so we can peacefully visit Fleeland. Please subscribe. Please do it for Dank. And now... And this is the Thor spawn we're trying out. We're not having the best of luck today. Um, this is actually an interesting but kind of awkward spawn in a way. So we have two camp luxuries. That's nice. I'll also move my word to see a little bit more. And we have... Uh, I like that there's coast nearby so that we can probably get to the faraway content this way, hopefully. I like the mountain so that we can get a good uh, holy site if we want, or campus. With the hills we can get good acropolises. Uh, but where do we actually settle? Because that is um, a little bit of a tough question. If you, because if you settle on grassland hills, you actually don't get a any extra benefits. Because it's a 2-1 uh, already. I'm thinking of actually settling over here. I will also spawn with woods in the... Uh, in the immediate range, um, in the first ring, then I can get a camp there, maybe go for Temple of Artemis Acropolis, something like that. Um, yeah, it does mean that I can only settle one city on this river, but I think realistically that was going to be the case anyway. This is a diplomacy game, so I want to get a religion at some point for Mahabodhi Temple purposes. But let's get to this tile first and see where we go from there. Also, I hope that I'm not straight on top of another sieve again. Because that's what happened in the third spawn. That was so nice. 
There's another goodie hut, so I might actually pick this one up with the warrior. If there's someone too close. We'll see. First we'll settle here on turn 3, Athens. And let's go for a scout right away. And let's go for animal husbandry, because that makes sense. Because we have two camp resources we might want to improve early. Uh, it's Nalanda, but we weren't the first to meet them, so I am nervous about that. Um, oh, there's something here as well. That might be a Sith. Let's see if we can see it from here. It's Hong Kong, and that is a first meet. Interesting. Let's go to the governor screen, and uh, I generally like to do the Amani tour then, early. So I can get the Susan Tees, so I can benefit from like 0.1 uh, culture early, but uh, it's fine. Let's try to find this other sieve. Uh, before they find us, preferably. Oh, no, no, there are other problems first. And what would you give? You would give a spearman. Okay. Well, first we need to bring you back. And then work on a slinger. Benefit of that is that I might get the boost to archery early. And work on Temple of Artemis that way. Uh, I do hope that you guys won't ruin my plans for me. Just, just hang back. Hang back, Nalanda. It's fine. I, I've got this under control, I swear. Yeah, good. I Go for me. Water bag from my people. We I'm find Sahara Albeda by suzerining uh, Hong Kong. We are the first to, uh, to do that. And um, that also lets us discover volume, but we're not the first to meet them because I already saw... That there were borders over here. So we'll just stay the Susan of Hong Kong for now, I think. And we'll pick up an envoy there. Oh, that's nice. Then actually I will put the envoy into Volin. For the extra production on slingers and settlers and stuff. Um, and let's then transfer Amani to Volin. For an early first Susan. You're going to try and intercept that scout, which I think I can do by staying here. Not if the guy runs away, of course, but oh well. Try to pick up uh, this goodie hut now. They're chasing the scout for some reason. Cool. And we will find horses, hopefully. If there are yeah, no there's a couple of horses quite close by. I like that. So, let's get cracking on a builder here. Also, what are the envoy quests? We have a great general, a great writer, and state workforce. Little awkward, but I can live with that. Meanwhile, let's go for astrology so we can get an early holy site down. Let's make sure that Nalanda doesn't get doesn't gang up on the barbarians too much. You going to come out? Yep. There's a monitor. Hello. Honor to meet you and Brazil. Bom dia. É uma honra conhecê-lo pessoalmente. Parece que mentes brilhantes se atraem. With that, we actually have a good um, jump towards a golden age, I think. We'll move you here. And start pelting you. And... Um, I, I do want to clear this at some point, but I think I'll hold out for now. Oh, this will be interesting to pick up as well. What do you give? You give a barbarian horseman. Eh. Not too excited about that. Um, you want a Eureka for the wheel, Auckland? Auckland is also nice to get since we're a little coastal. I do feel like we're we're sandwiched a little between mountains and, and uh, city-states and the coast. We might need to um, expand overseas relatively early. There's the boost to archery. Amazing. And, yeah, keep going.
Oh, Brazil denounces us. Interesting. W what are you gonna do, Brazil? We also find Hatusa, who are already suzerained by, um, by Nubia. Five envoys? That's just excessive. <laughs> That's excessive. Another recon unit, nice. So you can make your way this way. Try and see if this this is just blocked off or anything. That's good to know. Um, uh, let me think. Does it make sense to try and get some gold out of you? Mm, not really, I think. I think I'll just get the error score here. And irrigation is boosted by that. After the builder, I do want one settler. Because we kind of need to get to uh, to some places with more food. And also it would make sense to get that on the coast so we can get to, uh, to sailing. Um, try to make your way this way. Maybe we can help out here with some barbarians. I don't know. It is not wisdom, but all... Let's go for survey, god king, and urban planning here. And let's go for craftsmanship. The village that was highlighted here earlier is gone. So we'll just move this way. You will heal up. Try to intercept that scout. Here, we can get our first camp. Very good. I do want you to focus on production for now. Yeah, shave a turn off of that settler. I think that works. Even if you don't grow. Yeah, nice. What would that give an archer? So do you already have archers? No, not yet. Good, good, good. Then let's help out over there. Um, I want a copy of horses, basically. So I think I'll just settle here. And, yeah, get that camp. Or, uh, get that pasture. Hydration check. Hey, yeah, and thank you, Kudility. Yeah, congrats with 1,000 subs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's time to find out how that AdSense stuff works. You going to attack? No. I don't believe in astrology. Good, then I can attack you. Also, may this is a little awkward to like put the holy site over here. Maybe I want it there. I don't know. I don't know. Well, there is some room here. That's nice. I can get a city here. Time to claim economical victory on YouTube. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll need to get a new bottle after the this recording, but... Uh, City-state units in the way. Okay, let's go to archery now. And you die! Oh, is this just open to me? Well, don't mind if I do. And take Alpine. You're just going to wait there until further notice. Try to help out over here. Although, this doesn't look great. Yeah, no, they take that. Yeah. Sad. Oh, we have one of those, like, famous mountain massives. Um, that's just great. And there's Congo. Another error score, of course. 
We'll sample your hospitality and we'll burn this thing to the ground. Yeehaw! Gives us the uh, promotion or the invitation to vampires. Um, I would really no, well, no, we we'll, won't get <laughs> we won't get this Susan T anyway. Uh, but maybe we can get it to Auckland. Well, I don't have a mineable resource is the problem. So I think after archery, I try to go toward bronze working. Oh, there's silver. Hmm. I still think that's not the best idea to go straight for that silver mine. Um, how can I find out the most here? I think moving this way. Almost got our first uh, settler. Yeah, that's just fantastic. Hmm. I have to get an aqueduct city here. Yeah. Oh well. Okay, I'll need I'll need to know what board is here. Hmm. What would it take? Oh, only fourteen gold, that's fine. Okay. And yeah, you're you're just kind of chilling now. Maybe maybe find out more about this stuff. You can go here and here. Trek through Congo. We need 10 more points in 15 turns or well, a little bit more than 15 turns. Uh there goes Etmananki to Congo. Good on them. I think I'll settle this city first. And then we have four turns before we want to start on... Um, mm, I think this is your... Like, this is the capital's holy site. Buy this tile for Artemis and then that for the holy site. Work on that. It'll be a plus two, so no error score from that, but that's fine. Move through there. Mm. Yes, give me money. Okay. To find out more about this southern coast. Three hugging mountains weren't a thing. River goddess would be a fun pantheon. Yeah. Yeah, this this is rough to start next to so many dead tiles. Really squeezed here. But we'll see if it works. At least it times out nicely with starting on... Um, starting on Artemis. And we got the boost to foreign trade. That I like. Let's head there. Nice Nubian pyramids, although you overdid it a little, I would say. I think that getting one Nubian pyramid is certainly fine. But maybe not three. Um, I want to give us a warrior. This is awkward. I'll just move along this way. Uh, you're ready to settle. That's nice. Let's go. Get this pasture. And you could get a holy site there. I might have to, just in the service of... Um, Oh, you want to get stone in? There's no way I get stone in, right? There's no way. Nah. Um, let's just get to work on the monument because my 
<laughs> My culture is atrocious. Um. What? Oh yeah, right. Yeah. I th I think I think I misunderstood how you how you wrote it down because it seems like you said that the adjacency was changed by the river, but it's it's yeah. But uh, I I I understand. I think in principle, yeah. Okay then. Getting a galley might not be a bad idea, actually. And it might also not be a bad idea to get this pastoral line. Go this way. You settled on copper. No, on maize. Okay, that's fine. Still off of fresh water, but... For a moment, I thought she settled on copper, which, as Nubia, I think is kind of a mistake. Okay, this is a dead end. Because why wouldn't it be? I can, yeah, I can try and sell some horses to get a galley out. That's a good idea, I think. I shot an arrow into the air. There's archery, so we can get going on Temple of Artemis after this. You're just going to come down. Um, you're going to explore more. Yep. Um, yeah, you, you do kind of have to wait right now. There's the Cree. And we will exchange information on capsules. That's good. Yeah, an unmet bu player built stone in. So I think I would have had literally like two turns of production in there. Or maybe a couple more, but... <laughs> yeah, that was never going to happen. <laughs> um, Temple of Artemis, let's go! Will we get... We maybe can get Artemis within this era. Well, that would be... Interesting. Need 155 here. Ooh, yeah. Hmm. You have to deal with this, Congo. This is your problem. Zambuatu. Oh, come on. Okay, screw you. Oh, this is also great. Great, great settling, uh, great settling, Brazil. You're, you've outdone yourself. If you're going to grow to that uh, stone instead, I'll get a quarry there. Next turn. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah. Oh, I see what you mean now. That the adjacencies are too good off of the river to pass up on that. So there's iron here. So Hatusa has bronze working. Which makes sense. I haven't prioritized getting there. I haven't even boosted it yet, which is sad. Yeah. I thought that maybe I could make something happen there. Maybe I can, but... Oh, now you're growing to the horses again. Man, make a decision. <laughs> okay, I could get River Goddess. I'm I'm thinking it's Monument to the Gods. And of course, yeah, the, the, the one food, one production on the camp would help me get uh, Artemis as well. The thing is... Like, I'm, I'm just not going to have a bunch of camps in the long run. Um, whereas I am probably going to... Like, I'm probably also going to try for Colossus at some point. And uh, uh, Mausoleum is a classical era wonder. So I think that in the long run, this is going to do more for me. That shaved another turn off of Artemis, in fact. Although, of course, yeah, one production would also have shaved up 
quite a bunch there. Uh, you're just going to wait until the city makes up its mind where it's going to grow. And can we get enough gold now to get a galley? Yes. Yes. Boop. Our own first seafaring unit. And let's wait. As the uh, pounds of drums, uh, pound the drums of pound maker are going strong. Yeah, just stay here. the The warrior should kill itself on you. Just defend this pass, please, while we get our uh, slinger in position. Yep. Yeah, box him in. And stand here. You'll probably get attacked though. Oh well. Okay, is this another sieve? I think it is. Congo and Brazil at war. Who deserves more credit? And that's 52 damage on the. Uh, wait. Oh yeah, we built kill the barbarian warrior. Nice. I can get there. Nice. Find Cardiff. Train a hoplite. Oh, would that I could game. Would that I could. Um. And the spirits. Whee! And it gives me the boost to wheel, which was Auckland. And we ball. Yeehaw! It's like white and red. Canada or Poland, perhaps? You just, just stay here for now. We do have to pull back with you this way. And, oh crap, you're stuck. Oh no. Shoot. You do need to get out now. Ah. There's Xi'an of China. Yeah, I, I do want another builder to finish uh, finish that wonder. But I'll need the money first. Money. I think we're losing that slinger. Because knowing the AI, this this warrior walks away, and then the uh, spearman targets me. Huh? Ah! Hey, man, you can have the the camp if you want. Just please let me let me survive this. Um. If you're going to grow there, okay, I I'll, I'll go there. In more positive news, we it does look like we'll uh, um, get our golden age. You can... Hmm. Work on... Work on an archer, I think. Or work on a builder, so that maybe we can help out... No, because the, by that time, uh, Archman should be done. Yeah, I don't think we're, we're going to get to a builder in time to help with this. So it's either we get it or we don't. That That's the profound quote of the week. We either get it or we don't.
great profit going. Every nation lives Ooh, by. Ooh, the slinger lives. The slinger lives. Oh, now you're going to the pasture again. Very cool. Make up your mind. Discipline. Rest is fine. And let's go for craftsmanship now. Yeah, that works. Culture is pretty slow this game. Can I please walk through your land? It's another couple of gold I didn't want to miss, but oh well. And let's get this pasture. Without craftsmanship. Nice. Let's get Ilkum in the mix. That works. And go for state workforce. Are you going to do anything about this, or not? I mean, it's fine, but it's kind of weird. Also, we got the first suzerainty of Auckland there. So this, oh, this tile is now actually quite workable, honestly. Um, yeah, yeah, this works fine for me. Three turns on Artemis. Three turns on the air as well, though, so, hmm. Uh, do we have another point of error score waiting for us? Oh, we'll have to see. Hmm. Yeah, that didn't change it. Uh, Levy Auckland is 240. Which is a little steep, I think. For me. I also won't get to hoplites in time. Um. I also won't get enough money to buy... Unless I sell away my ivory. Yeah, I can do that. If I sell me my ivory, get gold from... Let's first sell the horses, actually. Um... <coughs> right. Let's time it precisely. Yeah, there you go. Two more there. Then sell the ivory. Uh, sure. Then get a builder. We're going to, like, nail the timing here. Yeah, because we wouldn't get that camp. You're going here. You're right, right on the money here. Wait there. You also need to get back somehow. Because that's a dead end. Okay, as long as we don't lose Temple of Artemis this turn, we're on for a Golden Age. Ladies and gentlemen. As long as there's no like easy way you didn't lose any units or anything, so... The last couple of movements, see if I find someone, for example. 
Uh, find a city state, but nothing that gives me air score. So here we go. When I saw the house of Artemis that mounted to the clouds, those other marvels lost their brilliancy. And I said, Lo, Lo apart, apart from, from Olympus, Olympus, the sun never, never looked, looked on aught so grand. There you go. Ground poetry boosted. That's nice. And, um, yeah, with that, we, uh, we have a good basis to go into the classical era with. I think after bronze working you go for sailing to get this these fishing boats online. Uh, meanwhile, I think I would like you, because you've got Ilkum Urban Plank. I think I would like to work on a builder here as well. Um, though, of course, next era you could change policies. Uh, but we haven't gotten to early empire yet. This is a really slow start. In fact, honestly, work on a monument here, because boy do we need it. Um, yeah, because we just don't have any... Uh, any. At least we, with a hoplite we can also get uh, envoys here. But yeah, we need, to, we need to step on the gas to get to uh, political philosophy in any like reasonable amount of time. So, next turn, as we go into a golden classical era. I'm also interested What's in that? creating a lasting legacy. Because bronze will last for thousands of years. And so will we. Sadly, no iron in the empire, despite all those naked hills. Where is the iron? Well, YouTube, if you want to know how I feel about this, then uh, do please uh, leave a like, comment, and subscribe so you know when the next episode goes live, and we will see you then. Bye-bye.